Hello everyone. Well, for various reasons, uh, there is difficulty getting the Abbott test. We were getting them from the state, but then the state now is having difficulty uh, procuring those. So the county purchased a new type of rapid antigen test. It is still a lateral flow test. So you will be seeing this at the stations here in the next week or two. So I wanted to go over it. Um, the process that you will follow to test so that you're not surprised whenever you see it. Inside of the box is a, uh, a procedure on how to do the test. So if you don't watch the video or forget what I said in the video, there is a process inside of the box. Inside of each box are 25 tests. There are 25 of the cards, 25 nasal swabs, and then 25 of the individual little fluids that's also the dropper. Any solution inside the box can be used with any card. They do not have to be matched up. So you will take the card, open it, just like you already do. These cards are a little bit different. They look a little different. This is what it looks like. So you have the place where you put the sample. You have the test and the control line. On this one, the control line is not there already. It will develop as you put the fluid into the, into the test strip. So you lay that there. And then I'm going to perform my actual test here. So what you do is you take the full lid off of the solution to where it's open. There is solution inside of this, so please don't spill that. Take the swab, just like you currently do. It's four swabs, or four in each nostril. Then you take it and place it inside of this and rotate it back and forth 20 times. Once you're done with that, you discard this into the trash, place the top back on, and screw this on. Then the purple comes off, and it becomes a dropper. Then you put three drops into the, the area marked S, one, two, three. Put the top back on this. This can then just be discarded. And then for this test, you wait 20 minutes versus 15 minutes. So at 20 minutes is when you read this test. So we're gonna pause, come back, and I'll show you what it looks like. It's been 20 minutes, and just like the Abbott test on this test, two lines indicate that it's a positive. If you only have one line on the control, that is a negative. And then if you have no lines or a line on the test but not on the control, then that is an invalid test and you will need to test again using a different card, different solution and everything. So this is my actual test. And as you can see, there is a line on the control but nothing on the test. So therefore, it is a negative test. Once you complete the test, you'll go ahead and report it just like you normally do. Again, if there's any questions, the instructions are found inside of the uh, box or you can rewatch this video. Thank you and have a great day.